food. So particular issues going on today, if we were to test you now, um, what? You would probably, most likely my sinuses this spring. Um, okay. It's this carpet dust environment. Uh, Inescapable allergens exactly. that your body reacts, overreacts to. Oversensitive. Overreacts. And you, did you see some improvement with allergy with a cleaner diet? Did you Definitely. Notice? Less mucus. Um, just removing any type of dairy. And that's less mucus right there. Um, right. So the externals maybe you can't control completely, right. but by controlling the internal environment, it was better able to cope with that's stressors it. from outside. I was better able to cope, and that's the key. Because it, you're right, it doesn't eliminate the, you know, it's not meant to, to cure, but it is meant to help, you know, deal better with, and, you know, instead of running to drugs, which, you know, I contemplate, okay, should I go get Claritin? No, I can just, you know, clean up my clean diet. Up my we can do a body scan if you'd like yes. on uh, camera. Yes. Uh, we'll do it standing. Okay. And in my office, we might test standing. We might test lying down, mm -hmm. depending on the case. We're going to calibrate your energy so that if you were a new patient in the office, you would um, find this perhaps a bit unusual, testing your body, using your own body. Mm -hmm. And we'll use an arm because you're standing up. Now, it's hard maybe for the viewer to know what I'm doing, but I'm using a fair amount of pressure here to push your arm down. And it's pretty strong. I'm working very hard, and you feel that locked yes. arm mm -hmm. there. You can see, perhaps, I don't know, if, <laughs> if your bicep is visible. Uh -huh. And I'm going to put a finger here. So I'm entering the energy field, and your arm suddenly lost its power. If I flip my finger over, your energy's back. I'm pressing hard again. When I use this side of my finger, it really drops quite noticeably. You feel that. It's I feel very it. clear. You're and I have no control over it. <laughs> no control. It's a little bit like kryptonite if you're old enough to remember Superman. So now we know a locked arm indicates strong energy. And it's the nervous system we're testing. We're not really testing her strength. Uh oh, we'll do a full strong. body scan. Okay. But for demonstration purposes, if, if the organ is weak, the body's going to innately send energy to that organ, and the arm is going to feel weak suddenly. Yeah. If the organ has integrity, the arm will stay locked. So let's go ahead. We'll do a body scan of the brain. Good. The sinus. That one is pretty strong. That one's not so strong. Tonsils. Whoops. Do you have your tonsils? I have my tonsils. You have your tonsils. <laughs> okay, well, they need some help. <laughs> Thyroid is good. Here's your lungs. So that's not surprising. You have yeah. some respiratory issues. And your thymus gland. So the thymus gland, the mediastinum, that's the master immune support for the okay. body. So that's not surprising. Uh, let's go ahead and take heart liver, gallbladder, here's your stomach, and your spleen, your small intestine. So I'm just using designated areas of the body. Good. So those female organs are good, the kidneys are good, and the adrenals are good. So these are areas of the body fed by the nerve to that organ. So the body's smart enough to know if that nerve is experiencing a little stress, it's going to send energy from the arm to that organ. Um, so when people ask me, you know, is it good to take this substance? Is it, is it good to use a plastic bottle? Should I be drinking out of a, a metal container? We have to test it. There's really, I, I don't know anything. Now I can rely on the body to tell me. So we have food sensitivity. What I want to do is add some digestive enzymes to your system okay. to help reduce some of the impact of those foods that you've eaten and that you may continue to eat. So we put that in your energy field. You can hold on to it. Okay. Go back to that organ, match my pressure, and it gets strong again. Yes. I'm going to pulse it. Match one, two, three, four, five six. And we want it at 10. Right. So I want to add something here. I want to find out what else can I add to this that'll bring that thymus 
back to a 10. So I have specific nutrition for the thymus gland. These are plants and foods that the body will recognize specifically for that organ. Remember, specific nutrition right. gets specific results. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and then it goes weak. Yep. So I know that that organ is now optimally, energetically revived. Yes. We also had lungs, though, and sinus. Yes. So let's see what happens. We've corrected the priority. Which is the immune. Which was your mm -hmm. thymus gland. Look at the lung now. Strong. Feel it? Eight, nine, ten. And then the sinus match my pressure. One, two, three. So the wow, sinus still, still needs some support. Uh -huh. That's a real weak spot for you. All of this. Wow. This is amazing. Uh, Diane, thank you so much. The, the, thank you, thank you, thank you. We needed my to see My pleasure. This. All right.